Attention all filmmakers. You have short films or full features without a district. Come to www.fhffsd.org. That is the fantastic horror film festival. So hurry up. Submit now. Do you need key art poster for your horror project? Do you have a limited budget and about to hit the festival circuit? Are you looking for distribution and need visual art to help the process? Well, you're in luck. Go to www.posterlabworks.com and contact them for more information. They'll work with your budget and provide you some great key art. If you mention Gruesome Herzog when you contact them, they will include art for matching postcards and along with the poster. Contact them now. Airplane vs. Volcano in 2014. Directed by James Condyke and John Condyke. Written by James Condyke and John Condyke. This is an action film from, yes, the Asylum Films. Here's the cast. Ryan Buds as Private Thatch. Natalie Burtney as Jennifer. Dean Kane as Rick Pierce. Lexi Galante as Amy, Robin Gibbons as Lisa Whitmore, Tamara Goodwin as Rita Loss, Michael Hampton as Brian, Vaughn Harris as Major Stone, Zachary Haven as Tony, Lawrence Hilton Jacobs as Jim Kirkland, Glenn Johnson as Archibald, Patrick Lazara as Williams, Anthony Marks as Frank Matthews, Matt Mercer as Landon, Johnny Meyer as Naval Officer, Jonathan Nation as Captain Minor, James Andrew Oster as Bob, Pat Patterson as Shirley Jones, Mike Jerome Putman as Colonel Riker, Laura Alexandra Ramos as Sergeant Graham, Scarlett Redman as Beth, Jason Schaefer as Copper, Ralph William Tarr as Joseph, David Vega as Krieger, Jeremy Walker as Major Step, and Morgan West as Specialist Neil Tooley. Here is an interesting film by The Asylum. I want to give special thanks to James Condyke for sending me a link to review for my podcast. As everyone knows, I'm a big fan of The Asylum Pictures, Sci-Fi Channel, etc. And I love disaster movies, as I've been stating before. Here's one called Airplane vs. Volcano. Um, very unique. Dean Kane uh, is Rick Pierce. He's uh, one of the passengers. A great cast. Matt Mercer, who I've got to know from the movie Madison County, and so forth. I did an interview with him quite some time ago. It's about a uh, an island that hasn't been active for a volcano in a long time. And it all of a sudden erupts. We have an airplane in the air during the same time, and as you know with volcanoes, it causes a magnetic blah blah blah. You get the story. And it messes up everything on the plane, so it's stuck in autopilot. Um, The captain and the co-captain gets killed. So it's up to Rick Pierce to try and fly this plane to save everyone, plus himself, of course. In the meantime, you have Robin Gibbons, who is a volcano specialist, and her co-worker, Matt Mercer, happens to be on the plane flying from Los Angeles, so forth. So you have everything going on in here. Basically what happens is, of course, in these films, there are deaths. Um, It is a disaster film. You know, it's one of these typical asylum films, which, when I say typical, I don't mean nothing bad. It's just the way it is. It's just that they're made that way to find some heroes during a destruction. So you have these people in this plane dealing with the uh, volcano, dealing with no control of the plane. Uh, It's just a brilliant film, a great cast. I really love these films. Um, Again, I'm a big Asylum fan, so they are what they are. It is what it is. You know, it's just based on actual facts, I guess. That's what the title says. But it's it's a well-put-together film. Well shot, well acted, a great storyline. And the cast was brilliant. I mean, I can go on and on and on about this film, but 
If you are a fan of Asylum, if you're a fan of the Sci-Fi Channel, if you're a fan of disaster films, it's a good film just to sit back and watch. I mean, brilliant. I love these special effects. I mean, they are what they are. Like I said before, it is the Asylum. You're going to get what you get. And what movies are masterpieces? There really isn't, unless you want to go to the high budget, which that's not really my game. I'm an independent uh, fan of just putting films out there, make them interesting, and see what you can come up, you know, see what you come up with. And this is one of these films that I, I enjoyed. So, again, you have Rick Pierce, played by Dean Cain, who has to try and save himself and the people on the plane. There's another story to this film, crazy shit going on the plane. You have the typical nut job, and that was played by um, David Vega, and he was a character of Krieger. He was all about himself. A brilliant performance by Dave Vega. It's just, a, uh, you know, you have a, a kid in here, a mom, you have everything in here, and it's just an action-packed film from start to finish. I love this film. It's well worth a watch. And again, special thanks to James Klondike for sending me a link to review for my podcast. It's just a brilliant film. Matt Mercer was great.